I believe that ApeCoin is incredible. And why do I say that? It's because I believe that ApeCoin during the next bull run could hypothetically at least go to the price of $50 and hypothetically make all of those ApeCoin critics come running over to their girlfriend's boyfriend's grandma and start begging for that new Hori extender that they saw was on sale at eBay. You know, I guess that's going to be really embarrassing. However, in today's video, I want to talk about why I believe ApeCoin could hypothetically at least go to the price of $50 during the next bull run. You know, first of all, I think that the major driving force behind ApeCoin moving forward will be the other side metaverse. And when it comes to other side, in my opinion, it looks absolutely spectacular. You know, it's unbelievable. If you take a look at the other side, the graphics, in my opinion, are A+. And it looks completely different from the majority of the competition. A lot of other metaverses out there, they completely suck. You know, a lot of metaverses that exist right now, they look like they were made in someone's basement. You know, it looks really Kaka. And no, I'm not talking about Kaka the soccer player. I'm talking about the number two Kaka that actually stinks. You know, in my opinion, the other side is extremely revolutionary. And I think that the future of Other Side could look so amazing. I think that Other Side has the potential to be arguably the best metaverse out there in the future. And personally for me, I think that the metaverse overall has a lot of potential. Contrary to popular belief, a lot of those non-believers out there, they like to pull out their G-strings, they like to pull out their pom-poms, and they like to say, oh, the metaverse is done, people don't want to, you know, be involved with the metaverse anymore, all this type of nonsense. And here's the thing, as of right now, yeah, the metaverse is down. A lot of people... They have completely started to ignore metaverse-related crypto projects. However, here's the thing. I think that the best is yet to come. That's what she said. And the reason why I say that is because, according to McKinsey, the metaverse could reach $5 trillion in value by 2030. So clearly, in my opinion, the future potential of the metaverse is no joke. As of right now, yes, it may be down, but I think that moving forward, it's ready to shock a lot of people. And I think that moving forward, as the metaverse continues to grow, I think so will spectacular metaverses, much like other side. And here's a crazy statistic for you. If we take a look at this, there's currently over 130,000 holders when it comes to ApeCoin, which is absolutely amazing. You know, I think that if anything truly shows the conviction that people still have for the future of ApeCoin. You know, a lot of people are still holding ApeCoin and they are not being paper handed, you know what? You know, they still have great belief in the future of ApeCoin. And so do I. You know, I think that the future of ApeCoin could look so bright. And personally for me, I think that a major catalyst for the future growth of ApeCoin moving forward is the fact that ApeCoin did launch their very own NFT marketplace. And I think this right here is a genius move because in my opinion, NFTs, they have a lot of potential. For instance, according to Grandview Research, the NFT market by 2030 is projected to be worth over $211 billion. A very crazy amount. So I think that clearly NFTs, they have so much potential and I think that its future could look so unbelievable. I think that ApeCoin launching their very own NFT marketplace is such a genius move. NFTs, much like the metaverse, is down right now. But I think the future could look so amazing. And personally for me, I think a major catalyst which could very well allow ApeCoin to hypothetically attain the price of $50 during the next bull run is the fact that I do think that the next bull run could look so unbelievable. And the reason why I say that is because there's currently more people than ever before in the history of owning cryptos. And that's actually not a joke. Currently, there's over 420 million people around the world owning cryptocurrencies. And just to put this number into perspective, Back in 2021, you know, during that massive bull run, that's what she said. At that point, there was roughly only around 300 million people on cryptos. And yet, still even despite that, the bull run that year looked that unbelievable. So you gotta imagine just how legendary the next bull run could look like, especially now that we have over 420 million people on cryptocurrencies. You know, in my opinion, when you have that many people, the FOMO could be insane. The buying pressure could be through the roof. The altcoin season could look so unbelievable. And when I take all those factors into consideration and I combine that with the fact that I do think that ApeCoin is incredible, I do think that ApeCoin during the next bull run could hypothetically at least go to the price of $50. I truly do believe that. And now of course that's all financial advice, but a lot of complete disasters out there or should I say clown shows, they make videos on ApeCoin but then all they do is they pull up a chart on ApeCoin and they try to use leverage, they try to day trade, you know they draw some random triangle and they say, Oh wow, cash out here, buy here, do this here, oh pull out your G-string here, oh pull out your pom-poms here. You know, they like to say all this type of nonsense, but 
Personally, for me, I don't do any of that type of craziness. I just like to keep it simple. I dollar cost average. I am ignoring the short to medium term price movements and I'm focused on the next bull run. I'm just accumulating on a consistent basis. In my opinion, people who day trade or use leverage is the equivalent of an individual buying a home with a leaky roof that they know they can't afford to fix. And no one wants to be in a position like that because, in my opinion, that is a major recipe for a ginormous, that's what she said, disaster. And I don't want to get wrecked and that is why I like to keep it simple, again, right, by dollar cost averaging. And by dollar cost averaging, I believe that I am preparing myself for the next bull run in such a fantastic way. And I wouldn't be surprised whatsoever if ApeCoin during the next bull run did go to the price of at least $50 and made all of those ApeCoin critics come running over to their girlfriend's boyfriend's grandma and start begging for that Hori extender, or should I say Malachi extender, Panther tail extender, whatever it may be, right? I am so bullish on the future of ApeCoin. I can't wait for the next bull run. And if you want to check out a very interesting video, make sure to go ahead and click on this thumbnail right here. It's a very interesting video, and I think you all would really love it. It's been Lee the Captain, and I'll catch you all on the next one. I'm out. Peace. Bye. Thanks for watching.